My name is Rami Borstein. I'm a professor of anesthesia and neuroscience at Harvard Medical School. So, sensitivity to light, uh, which is called photophobia, has been around for many, many years. And since 2010, we learn a huge amount of information about why and how light makes the headache more painful, why patients prefer dark, and why light is aversive way beyond just making the headache more painful. It is aversive because it is associated with, with negative emotion, with unpleasant re responses that are autonomic. There is a direct wire that goes from the retina, from the eye, into a part of the brain in the thalamus that and converge crosstalk with neurons that are activated during migraine. When you turn on the light and you have a migraine, usually the light will make the head, your headache about 10 to 20 percent more painful. It will not take it from 3 to 10. It will take it from 3 to 4 or 3 to 5. When you turn off the light, usually it will take your, your headache intensity from 8 to 7 or 8 to 6, but not from 8 to 0. So what is the big difference? Why is it so important that we tackle photophobia? Not because it takes your headache from 3 to 10 and from 10 to 0, but because the difference between 6 and 8 is the difference between bearable and unbearable pain. At pain of 6, many of them function, and at pain of 8, they have to go to bed, they have to go to a dark room and they quit work and quit making dinner and quit interacting socially with the environment. So if we can take the headache intensity down from an unbearable to a bearable, which sometimes will be one or two numbers, we will give them an ability to continue to function in spite of having a migraine.